everyone, it's Jay Warren with another On The Clock. You know, it's that time of year again, severe weather season. Arlington certainly can be in the path of some of those storms. And we have a team that is monitoring the weather constantly and also ready to respond if we are hit with severe weather. Here's Trey Yelverton, our city manager, pulling the curtain back on our emergency operations center. <laughs> Thanks, Jay. Today I'm at the Ott Cribs Public Safety Center and I'm here in our Emergency Operations Center with our Emergency Administrator, uh, Iris Hancock, who's going to show us a little bit around what we have here and a little bit about your capabilities in order to keep us all safe out there. So, Irish, tell us about where we're at. Well, as you mentioned, we're in the EOC, the Emergency Operations Center. The purpose of this facility is whenever we have a significant special event of national or international importance, such as Super Bowls or the upcoming World Cup, as well as when we have emergencies and disasters like tornadoes, floods, wind events, this becomes the center of the universe for the city of Arlington. Well, it's all quiet in here today, and that's yes. exactly how we like it. Absolutely. But for days when it's a little more busy, let's take a look at some of the resources and tools you have to kind of deploy. Uh, we'll start with our video wall. Um, as you see here, this is our brand new video wall. We just upgraded the technology just a, a month ago. With this system, we have the ability to put any of the audio, the video, the graphics, the media, whatever we need to any corners of the EOC for those sections to be able to see the information they need to be able to respond appropriately and more importantly, make the right decisions. During a tornado, we'll have 20, 30, 40 people in here and they all need to see different aspects of information. Well, I think we're gonna go upstairs now and maybe look at kind of how the siren system works. Excellent. So let's go take a look at that and uh, see how, how it works to activate this. I have uh, my EMC, Shauna Limley, will be happy to show you how to activate the sirens. All right, let's go. So now I'm here with Shauna Limley in our 911 system. She's our emergency management coordinator and you're gonna show me how the, the outdoor warning siren system works and just for everybody's sake we're in training mode so we can't actually set this off right correct but you're going to show me what it looks like if we were in an actual emergency and how it works yes so tell me what how how this system works so we have 53 sirens all across the city we're currently on the page where we can actually activate the sirens and so in order to do that um, we're in training mode so we're good to press buttons now <laughs> so what we'll do is we'll press this button first would, mm -hmm. this, would this actually turn them on or Not just yet. starts the process? It just starts the process. Okay, so we're going to start the process. We'll start Boom. that one first. Okay. And then we're going to click all sirens. Okay. And then you're going to press the, the green start. Mm -hmm. And then once they're activating, they'll all turn turquoise. And there they go. They're okay. all activated. So they're all, so in a, in a real deal, I would know that they're all being alerted. Mm -hmm. This mm -hmm. is where you guys come and you mm -hmm. do just what you showed me to do, only real mm -hmm. or any any time during all the other times, this is where it all happens. This is where we do anything with our sirens right here at this computer. Interesting. Emergency operations is clearly one of the most important things we do to serve our residents. And so we're very appreciative of the hard work that you and your team do here on behalf of our residents and our whole staff on how, how we're working to serve. I just want to say thank you very much. Thank you. And thanks for all your hard work. Thank you. Thanks, Trey, and thanks for you at home for watching. Tune in next time for another On the Clock.